Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be doing for you a huge collective summer clothing haul. So I have been kind of collecting for a couple of weeks now, just stuff that I'm really excited about for summer. Um, a lot of the pieces are like layering pieces just because I feel like I have a ton of clothes. I just like to add in pieces here and there that can really help I guess just make the stuff that I have look a little bit different each season, look a little bit more trendy for what's kind of going on right now. So I'll tell you exactly how I style everything um, and I'll try and leave links if you have any questions just leave a um, comment below and I'll try and find the link for you or something similar if you need any links to anything specific. But I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and if you want to see what I'm going to be wearing all summer then please keep watching. First is a shirt from H&M. It is like a denim boho, you can kind of see bell sleeved. Um, shirt that's kind of a high-low short in the front and longer in the back um, this like I said is from H&M I have been obsessed with this like it is just so so easy to throw on I actually wore it out to lunch with some friends with um, a pair of like green denim like army green shorts denim shorts um, and some cute booties and um, I've been wearing it just a lot I've worn it out with gray jeans and some booties at night I feel like you can dress it up dress it down you can wear it with white denim um, and I just love anything jean, obviously, I mean a jean jacket, um, but I feel like this has like a little bit more trend and style to it, so I really, really like this, and I recently picked this up from H&M. Next, I'm going to talk about some stuff that I got from Forever 21. So the first thing I have picked up were two like long kimonos. The first one is this all lace really long um, like eyelet kimono. It has short sleeves, um, and it's really, really pretty. I actually got this for a cover-up. Um, so I don't really plan on wearing this like out. I mean, I think it would be really cute with like a white tank top um, and white jeans and just some like tan heels or something. It would look like really angelic and pretty or if you're um, a bride and you're having like a casual bridal shower or something, I think this would be really pretty. But I picked it up to wear over like an all white bathing suit. I love this look like just throwing on one of these like long kimonos. I feel like you look so like, I don't know like you don't live where I live um, and it's like fancy and cute so I'm really excited about this this one was $34 which I thought was a little pricey for Forever 21 but I think it is made really nicely and I really do like it it looks a lot more expensive than that um, but just from Forever 21 it seems expensive so I really like it I still do think you could wear it out but I didn't get it for that purpose but if I do wear it out I'll try to like take a picture and style it for you guys so you guys can see okay so then I got another one and this one I did get to plan or I did buy planning on wearing it out and I already have so this is just like a tan long sleeve really really long one um, it has some slits like if you can see I'll try and stand up and show you in the back um, it's like it's slit from the sides um, I just think it's so pretty this was $12 from Forever 21 um, and what I really like about it is that I wore it with like a white tank top tucked into some jean shorts with booties the other day and it's just like a really cute look. It reminds me, I don't know if you guys ever saw that picture of Chrissy Teigen. She's wearing like a naked wardrobe, long, um, like overcoat with jean shorts and like strappy heels. And I just thought it was so cute. Um, and this one was only $12. And I also feel like, again, you could wear this over a bathing suit if you wanted. You could wear this in the winter with like all black. So I think this one's really versatile. And for $12, I was like, you know what? The trendy stuff I love to get from Forever 21 because you don't feel guilty if you don't like it the next season so that's why I picked this up so next I'm gonna talk about two shirts that I got from Forever 21 they're just plain long sleeve like almost they're not crew neck they kind of are like high neck t-shirts so I got one in aqua I know it's showing up really white on camera so I think you can see the color a little better back here it's like a aqua blue shirt and then I got the same one in black and I really got these for like layering purposes um kind of like I mentioned I wear a lot of just like plain stuff and then I like to like accessorize or have like a cute jacket that's really the, the point of what I'm wearing so I thought the black one was really good I've worn it with like all black and like a cheetah belt and red shoes um, I think it would be cute with a bunch of different things and I think they're just like really nice they almost look like bodysuits when they're tucked in but they're not which I love and then I just thought the blue was like a nice color they were seven dollars so I was like let's just see how they work but I think the blue would be really cute with like all white um, or even I don't know just maybe even all black and with the pop of blue I just think it's really pretty I love this color um, and I think it's a nice contrast from a lot of the colors that I wear all the time so love these little t-shirts um, they had them in a bunch of different colors so I would check them out next I'm going to talk about some stuff that I purchased from Zara so the first thing is um, this skirt I think this skirt is so cool and trendy right now this skirt was um, $69.90 um, and it's just like this suede quilted 
skirt that I think is so versatile and cute. So let me tell you how I'd style it because I know you're kind of probably like, oh, I don't know about that. So with the, the black t-shirt that I just showed you, and I'll show you some heels later that I'm definitely planning on wearing this with, but like some cute strappy heels. And then I also think you could do the boho look with it. I have a really old pair of like suede 70s looking wedges, which I think would be so cute with this as well. And then like pulling out the tan color. Um, and then I also think in the winter you could still wear this because it's suede. Um, you could wear it with all black and some black tights and like some booties and look really, really cute in the winter as well. So I just love this skirt. Um, I plan it on wearing to a wedding shower that I have to go to that's like an outside barbecue theme and I'm just going to wear it with just a plain black shirt and I'll show you the heels later. But I just think it's so cute. It's a little different. It's kind of out of the ordinary for me, but that's why I'm excited about it. Okay, so you're probably going to notice a theme of a color coming up pretty soon, and that is the blush tone family. I am obsessed with blush tones, and next from Zara, I got this adorable floral and blush and black bomber jacket. It has, like, this black striping, and then on the back, um, it's like that, and it's coming up a little white on camera, but it is, like, a blush tone pink. Um, I think that this will be cute with a lot of things, so I'll show you what I bought it with first, and then I'll kind of explain why. So, I also purchased the matching, like, wide leg floral pants. They are so cute. They go all the way down. They're super wide leg. Um, really, really, really cute. Um, loving this whole outfit together. Like, I think it's gonna be so cute with, like, a black tank top tucked in, and I actually also bought this for another wedding shower that I have to go to, um, and I just, I plan on wearing, actually, the whole outfit. But the reason why I got this was because I think that they're also really, really good separates. Um, so I, pl I think you can wear this with just like a white t-shirt or a black t-shirt and just some flip-flops and the pants. And then I love the jacket with like a black tank top. And um, you could even kind of dress it up for work if you need to wear like dress pants and heels. You could wear it to with just like some white jeans um, or like the outfit together. Or I even think you could wear this out at night with like a black tight like bodysuit and some high-waisted black shorts and some strappy heels. So I think it has a lot of uses, so that's why I purchased it, but I just love this set. I love it together. I love it separate. I love floral prints. I'm a sucker for them, so picked this up at Zara. So next from Zara, this was on sale, and I they had a ton of them in my store, um, and actually my mom got it in another color, but it's like this little overcoat, like almost like shawl-ish thing. This is the bottom detailing. And then this is the sleeves. It just has that super cute, like, boho trend going on. And I just love it. I actually was wearing, like, this color of a tank top when I was there, like a tan tank top. And I just threw it over just to see. And I fell in love with it. And I cannot wait to wear this with, like, some jeans and just that tank top. And then you have something in case you're inside and cold. But you still can be really summery and, like, boho chic. And I just think it's so cute. I'll definitely show you guys how I style this. If you have any more questions, let me know. But... Um, it's a little weird and like it was on sale for $30 and I was like, I think it's fun I'm kind of, I have a little bit of like a weird edge to me sometimes in my style So stuff like this really excites me, but I know to like the naked eye you might be like, oh my god That is hideous, but I love it. So next from Zara. I also got this bathing suit, which is totally out of the ordinary for me so it is like completely v-neck all the way down um, and completely open in the back but the reason that I got this is because I feel like I'm getting to the age where a lot of my friends are starting to like get married and there's a lot of girls trips going on all the time and I think this is so cute for something like that now I'll be honest with you I will not wear this like to the beach with like my family or just to the pool like that I belong to here um, but I just think stuff like this is so fun and trendy and I'm pretty sure it was like only like 12 or 15 dollars or something so I'm like even if I wear it once or twice I think it's so fun um, and I have no boobs um I know maybe TMI but I don't so stuff like this doesn't look crazy on me because it really isn't showing off much of anything at all so got this as well so moving on to Nordstrom I think I got a good bit of the stuff from Nordstrom so um the first thing that I got was this Bobu B-O-B-E-A-U I don't know how you say that blush long tunic actually um, but I got this to actually wear it as like a vest. I actually have worn this. I wore it with just all white underneath and some cute boots. Um, and I just think that that look is so cute. Like some of these vests that I loved in the store were like close to $100 or $200. And I think it's a little trendy. And I thought saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, I could just wear that unbuttoned and like pull off that same exact vest look. So that's why I got this. Um, and it worked. It worked perfectly. I just completely unbuttoned it and just pretended it was a vest and nobody knew that it was actually a tunic. So, super cute. Um, I know that they had a ton of these in stock in a ton of different colors, so if you want to kind of try that look as well, then you should pick this up too. Next, I got a new pair of white jeans. These are my favorite jeans of all time. It's the Topshop Moto Jamie jeans. 
Um, I have them in like gray and black, um, and I do have a pair of white jeans, but I wanted some distressed ones, so these ones have some holes in the knees. They're not too distressed, so they still look kind of nice. Um, but just so you guys know, like the fit of these jeans are high waisted and they're ankle grazers, which I love because a lot of times I want to show off my shoes. I'm like a big shoe girl. So when jeans go too far down, you have to like cut them or get them hemmed and do all that. I don't really love them, but these jeans are $75 and they are the best fitting jeans. They never stretch out. They just fit like a glove. I get them in this size. I guess, I don't know if it's saying, it's showing like the European size. Oh, USA size six. Normally I'm a size like four um, or two or four and I know that in Topshop you're supposed to go up a size so definitely make sure you go up a size but if you guys have not tried these Jamie jeans whoo you are missing out they are good girl next from Nordstrom where I know more blush but I got this blush leather jacket you guys this is probably what I'm most excited about this is from blank NYC I actually realized that I also have this in burgundy this exact same leather jacket I thought they were styled a little bit differently but when I brought it home and I checked it out of my closet I was like wait you guys are actually the exact same but this is in a blush tone. I think this is perfect to wear over almost anything all summer long when you're cold um, or if you're at the beach and it gets like breezy at night. And then I also think this will be perfect in the winter too with all black. So I think it was a really good purchase. It has some really nice detailing. It feels really nice. I think it was around $100, but it feels way more expensive and way more like legit leather. Uh, but I absolutely love this like moto trend with all white underneath or like all black. Um, I just think it's super cute and like I mentioned I kind of just got a lot of layering pieces so I really wanted to pick this up as well. Moving on to the shoes that I picked up from Nordstrom. So the first one I um, got these first and these are just a pair of black Steve Madden lace up heels. So they lace up around your leg like this and then they look kind of just like that in the front. Super super cute just chunky heels so they're super comfortable and they're not too high. Well, I got these, I wore them out, I was obsessed with them, so I decided to get them in another color. But these are the shoes I was talking about wearing with the blue suede skirt. I just love them. I think that they're super, super cute. I realized that the black wasn't that versatile for summer, so I also, which I do wear a lot of black, but I feel like I'm in a lot of blush tones and stuff like that, so I also got them in the taupe shade. Um, I just think I'll be able to wear these, like, even more. Um, just with all the all-white outfits and stuff like that with the pops of with the pops of color I just think that these are so 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 cute and I even love them I've, I love them with just like boyfriend jeans and a cute little like t-shirt I just think that they're so cute so had to get these as well oh no I have two more pairs of shoes so one more pair of shoes um I got these you guys are probably gonna be like that's not summer at all why did you buy these and put these in your summer haul but I actually also have these boots in um, black and they are the Steve Madden gorgeous over the knee boots they're called gorgeous I also think that they're gorgeous they tie in the back like that and they look exactly identical to the Stuart Weitzman boots for like a quarter of the price less than a quarter of the price normally these are about like 150 and I have them in black I showed them in my winter clothing haul um, but they came out this color and then they went on sale because it's not really super summery to wear over the knee boots and they were $75 and I just couldn't resist. I love my black ones. I got so much use out of them. And I just think with some dresses and stuff that these will be really versatile actually. Um, and I wear, I tend to wear a lot of black. So I thought like if I'm wearing like an all black dress or something and I just want to throw these on, um, I think that they're super cute. And I still love a boot in the summer. I know people are kind of iffy about that, but I do. So I had to get them. Next from Nordstrom's, I picked up a pair of sunglasses. These are from the BP section. Um, they are so cute. They are like... As you can see, like white and I guess brown, like tortoise shell or like cream and brown tortoise shell. Um, and they're like a really cute cat eye. They look a lot like the Wild Fox. Um, I believe that they're called the Sugar and Spice, or not Wild Fox, I'm sorry, Key Australia Sugar and Spice. And that's kind of why I got them because I've been, the only difference is they don't have the mirrored lens, but I was eyeing those for so long. They're only $50, they're not crazy expensive, but they're so trendy that I was like, why would I spend $50 on them? Like, if I may only like them this season and these were $12 from the BP section and I think that they look like just as cute so um they're right here as you can kind of see um they're super cute and they still have give you off that same look they're really really comfortable too like they fit nicely and they're really good to push your hair back which a lot of my like nicer sunglasses I don't like to do this with so I always reach for my cheaper sunglasses because I just want to put like my hair out of my face like this like um, with my sunglasses and I don't mind stretching out cheaper ones so I go for these ones a lot um, but yeah so if you guys are interested in those wild fox ones I mean gosh those key ones they do have them on Nordstrom.com but these ones were only like $12 so I went for these instead on the Steve Madden website I picked up these adorable 
lace up sandals so you just lace them around your ankle they are in hot red I mean they look kind of hot pink but they are hot red um, and they just lace up your sandals and then a the little tassel or up your ankle and these little tassels kind of hang in the front they are so cute they also had them in like a light blue which I was like dying for also black and tan um, but I went with red just because I thought I wear a lot of black and tan and I think that red is such a cute pop of color and I think um, with my hair color and things like that, red kind of just stands out. So I went with the red. I love them. I'm going to be getting a ton of use out of these. I can already tell this summer. They're super cute. Next, I want to talk about two tank tops, only because I don't really need to haul these, but I just wanted to talk about them. They are from Old Navy. Um, you can't really tell, but this one is like a perfect taupe, and this one is like a perfect blush tone. They are V on one side and then scoop neck on the other, and you can wear them reversible. So if you need a V-neck, you can, and if you need a scoop neck, you can. They are so soft and amazing for layering, and I'm pretty sure they're like buy one, get one free. So if you have an Old Navy near you, go check it out. They had a ton of colors, but I just thought like these were the two colors that I needed the most. Next, I want to talk about a Wild Fox sweatshirt that I picked up on Off Sacks, um, or Sacks Off Fifth Avenue's website. So it was on sale, and oh my gosh. It's like a blush tone sweatshirt that says rosé all day. I am obsessed with this. Like, you can ask my boyfriend. I have not taken it off since the day that I bought it. What I love the most about this is I love these Wild Flax sweatshirts, but a lot of times I'm like, I don't love what it says or like one thing doesn't apply to me or whatever, but this one does. One, rosé all day, yes. Two, I love the blush tone. I think it's even cute with like some white shorts and like a little pair of sandals just to run some errands. And three, like, oh my god, it is so soft and I believe it was only like $50 so if you guys are interested I know they had a ton on their website and a ton of different colors so go check it out. Next I want to talk about a pair of pajamas that I picked up from Target. I know it's so random but I just couldn't help but share with you guys because it's just so cute. I'm such a pajama set person like I go to bed every night in a pajama set. I know it's weird but this is the top. It's like black with some cream detailing and then like this adorable fringe detailing on the bottom and then it's like a strappy back. Like how cute. Like I want to wear the shirt out, okay? And then these cute little shorts with the same detailing on them and I believe this set together was like $15 from Target. I just think it's so cute. I'm obsessed with it. I've already worn them once and I know I'm going to be in them all summer. Love them. Last but not least, I know this is a ton of stuff. Um, I got this swimsuit cover up from Target.com. It is made by Mar, I believe like they did a line mar is called like a line that's done by vix if you've ever heard of those products um those bathing suits but it's like this deep v snake skin long dress with some really big slits in it and i just love this i have a lot of all black and all white bathing suits so i just think it's so cute it like ties in the front it has some cute tie detailing on the shoulders and i just think you look so like chic by the pool with like some dark sunglasses um and i just had to pick this up i absolutely love it check online because that's where i got it um i did not find it in any of the stores and i haven't seen it there since so check online for this so that i don't even want to say that is it for my summer clothing haul because i know it is a lot but that is what i've picked up recently for summer please let me know if you guys want me to explain in any more detail how to style it so that is it for this video I love you guys so 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 much thank you so much for all the love and subscribers that I've recently gotten I appreciate you guys more than you know I will see you guys in my next video love you so much bye